to show you how to get Siri on your iPhone 3GS 4, iPad 1, or iPod Touch 4G. So yeah, here's Siri. And if you don't believe me, I do have an iPhone 3GS. As you see, it has a curvier design, while the iPhone 4 has a more straight design. It's not curvy. So yeah, I'm going to go into Cydia, and I'm going to show you how I did this. So here we go, I'm in Cydia right now, I'm going to go click the search button down at the bottom, and I'm going to type Inspire, that's S-P-I-R-E, you had to have the Big Boss repo to get it, and the Big Boss repo URL can be um, installed on Installer or Cydia, and the URL is to the left or in the description below. So one thing you might need to know is that Spire is incompatible with the Big Boss semi-tether, so you're not going to be able to have a semi-tethered device. But you can have an untethered device or a tethered device, so that is good. And if we go down here, you'll notice Spire is a big download. It's a 100 MB download, so it's required that you have a Wi-Fi network or a strong Wi-Fi network. Now go on ahead and go up top, and we're going to click Install. We're going to install Spire onto our system. Mine says modify because I already have Spire installed. So now we can go back and go into our settings after you have Spire installed. And we can scroll on down until we find the Spire options. And here is where you can enter a proxy. We currently do not have any working proxies, but if I find one, I'll leave one in the description below. And actually now we're going to go back and we're going to go into the Surrey settings. So go ahead and scroll on up until you hit general and then you're going to click on Surrey and you're going to flip the Surrey option on. And once you do that you can set other options like your language and your voice feedback. If you want it hands free you can speak to it without having to touch a button. I'm going to turn mine on always. But that is it for the settings right now so we're going to go on ahead and go back. And I'm going to click my home button. I'm going to get Siri up here. See, I have the nice interface for Siri right there. But it does not work. I got a proxy on there, but the proxy is currently overloaded like most of the other proxies. And if you speak to it, it will just say try again later and a bunch of other stuff. So if any of you know of any working proxies, then please let me know by a message, and I'll be happy to insert it into my description. So everyone, please check back every once in a while, because I will be updating that description, and I guarantee within a few weeks you'll have a working proxy. But anyways, guys, thank you guys for watching. This is the easiest way to install